Hello. I've not done something in one moment. <laughs> Good start. You'd think after having over five minutes to sort something out, you would uh, make sure that the game's audio is coming through. Let's solve that issue while I'm doing that. Good to you all, and uh, happy Thursday. It's nearly the end of the week, and this is Not Going Rogue. Uh, as I've posted on the Immaterial Gamers Twitter, there we go, we've got sound. So much better. Um, yeah, as I explained on the Immaterial Gamers Twitter and Facebook page, I'm going to put Going Rogue back as a uh, YouTube-only series, and that'll be on our YouTube page, which is in the bio, and pretty much a lot of descriptions. It's the, 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 the URL where, uh, I can words good. The URL is long, so search Immaterial Gamers, or just click the link in our bio when, uh, whenever you want to see it. So anyway, we're going to continue our playthrough of Yakuza Like a Dragon. When we last left it, we were introduced to some of our main characters, uh, particularly our main main character, Ichiban Kazuga. A quite naive, over-emotional, but very, very caring member of the Awakawa family of the Yakuza. And when we last left, he was willing to go down for a crime he didn't commit um, to repay his debt for basically running around being a rebellious youth. So, uh, yeah, let's go. It's on to chapter two, a bloody reunion. Let's, uh, let's become battle-hardened prisoner. So this is summer 2002, so... He's been in here for a year and a half at this point. And doing what looks to be duty of packing chopsticks. That's your box. So you're gonna. Sir, I've completed my quota for the day. May I take a bathroom break? Very well. And, uh, well, there you go, we got out of that. Mm -hmm. Clearly, he's well known. And oh, down you go. So, where the yard is, used to be Tojo Clan. Of course, because you put all the organized crime members together in one cell, because that works. You be the perfect little prisoner and get back on the outside quick and easy? <laughs> Idiot, you're a murderer. You could act like a goddamn angel in here, but you won't be getting parole for at least ten years. So I'd say it's in your best interest to get along with us. <laughs> mm. Not much to say, huh? What family were you in? What was he going to say? Simple enough question to answer. Shh. Oh. Right. The Arakawa family. Arakawa? <laughs> you mean that little after school club of a family? Hey, I'll have you know that was a really cool family. Well, I mean, apart from the treasurer, who was an absolute dick. But, um,. I don't know, I didn't hear it, I didn't remember. <laughs> I said your family's a bunch of small time punks. Oh. Your patriarch may have been Arakawa the assassin once, but that was a long time ago. 
I heard he's gone fucking soft now. You got locked up for that washed up has been, and you think it means something. Oh, that's so fucking cute. Bastard. I'll kill you. Try your best, little bitch. Oh, the good old spitteroo. Why would they be allowed in here? Oh. The solitary? Is uh is that just bread? Why'd you suddenly fight back? You took it for a whole year. Those guys had to be taken to the police hospital for crying out loud. You knocked all their teeth out. Ah. They were talking shit about my boss. Your patriarch waiting for you on the outside? Yeah. They were calling him a nobody. Saying all this bullshit about him going soft. I couldn't just let that stand. Are you supposed to let it stand? Well, what's he gonna say when he hears the bad news? He won't hear it. That's why he beat their sorry asses. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about your sentence getting extended. I don't understand why anybody commits murder in the first place. But if there really is someone out there waiting for you, you should behave yourself. When someone believes in you, try not to disappoint them. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, life advice, policeman. Because, you know, it, it all works. Fifteen years later. I don't know if you really could do with a bikini bottom style uh, narration. Hey, it's a fly. Number eleven nineteen. Letter for you. Oh. Huh. Oh my God! He got a letter. Apparently, it's from someone important. No. <laughs> are they are they orders? That's from Harakawa son. Huh. Dear Ichiban, I wanted to avoid writing to you while you're in prison, but today my brush just called to me. If your sentence hadn't been extended, I would be planning your big welcome back party right now. Yeah. I can't tell you how sad I am that I can't do that. The days have been so lonely without you. Sometimes I think I hear your laughter in the office, but I always turn around and see that nobody's there. Still Only reading a it. Parent knows how truly empty a home can feel. Mm -hmm. Parents are nothing without their children. <laughs> there we go. He's out. I and he's spoiling a ponytail. When I will turn around and see your laughing face. And the door opens. P.S. The day you get out of prison. Let's get that picking duck we missed. Oh no, who's getting betrayed? So I've learned. Boss, I'm so sorry. Um. When I got into that fight, I wasn't even thinking about how long you had already been waiting for me. An Let's see, his, uh, his suit still fit. I did something stupid. I'm sorry I failed you. I held you up for so long, but I'm out now. I'm finally back.
Awkward. Thanks for the support, Mr. Mr. Good Advice, Prison Cop. Did you not know they've gotten more strict about enforcing the anti-Yakuza laws? No. It shouldn't surprise you that bosses aren't pulling up in fancy cars at prisons anymore. In the letter, he said he'd come for me. Not gonna happen. Just too dangerous these days. That's a shame. Yeah. Thanks for everything. Don't come back in here, you eh? Right. You, you're still looking I at really me. I thought the welcome wagon was coming. Oh, uh, hi. Of course, you being in the slammer for 18 years, only natural you'd be a bit mixed up. I gotta say, that's some deep loyalty you've got, waiting for a boss that never even visited you. Who the hell are you? Hot top. Yeah, good question. Kanagawa Police. A detective? Well, I used to be. Now I'm just a washed up DMV grunt, one year shy of retirement. Oh no, he's a year away from retirement. The slowest apartment ever doing here. Come to remind me to renew my license. Is that a service you offer nowadays? I'm oh, yeah. here because I have real business with you. So you, you waited? Murderer who shot a man on the last night of the 20th century. Heck, I even used some precious PTO to be here today. Wow. Ah. Uh, Sorry to disappoint you, but I don't plan on being a repeat offender. That's what everyone thinks when they get out. The moment they set foot on the other side of this fence... Do you call it a fence? That was pretty you clear to me that that is a wall. You were born and raised in Kamurocho, after being abandoned at the famous Shangri-La Soapland. Ah, the so owner, uh, you missed a detective exposition. You. Cool. And he and his prostitutes raised you. Well, after that, it's by the book. You dropped out of school, committed multiple offenses of shoplifting and assaults, then finally joined the Yakuza at age 16. Yeah, you did. But you had a largely unremarkable career as a member of the Tojo clan's Arakawa family. Yep. Uh, until the night you killed an officer higher up on the food chain. I mean, a lot of stuff now, happened at the turn of millennium in this game. 2001, <clears throat> you turned yourself in at Kamuro Police Station. Sentenced to 15 years of this prison, and then you're not five sets of teeth out. Years tacked on for bad behavior, we finally arrive at today, where you were just released about three and a half minutes ago. That about sum it up. Oh, you you uh, watched the cutscene as well. My biggest fan for sure. You want an autograph to show your DMV friends? I just do my homework. Great, whatever. I don't care why you're here. Just get out of my way. There's somewhere I need to be. Oh, paying a visit to the Arakawa family? Absolutely. It ain't none of your business. Just leave me alone. Oh, but actually, it is my business. It very much is. Nothing personal, of course. Now, you're free to go wherever you feel like, but I'm coming with. What? Are you serious? What? Whatever. Do what you want, man. Okay. I am walking away. Oh, okay, so am I. Uh, miss, I don't want to insult you, but... Uh, what uh, did you do to my hair? Hello. I tried. It's just when you asked for a punch perm, I had to look it up. The truth is, I've never done one before. Uh... 
I supposed to face the boss with a rat's nest on my head? Why didn't you just get it shaved, Ichiban? Oh, he's just waiting there the whole time. <laughs> well, they look unique now, at least. What kind of look are you going for, man? Shut up! I just ended up with a bad barber, is all. The hell's your deal, anyway? You really gonna just keep following me? I'm gonna say yes. I told you, I have business with you. All you had to say was yes. Patiently for you to take care of yours. So, what's next? You're creeping me out, man. Give me a break. Ta da! Oh! Uh, I wondered where you were going. Chief Kao Suzumori's grave, huh? Hold on. Isn't he the guy that was killed 18 years ago? Yeah, that's right. Oh, okay. okay. So, who killed him? You're looking at him. <laughs> Get real. You think I'm joking? Right, let me ask you this then. Why'd you kill him? Good question. from the Arakawa family, and I just, I, I was so mad, I just did it. Oh, good. Eighteen-year cover story. Just because you were pissed off. Yeah, I get mad. Boy with daddy's gun. You ain't that immature. He lives his life thinking it's Dragon Quest. I wouldn't be visiting the guy's grave. How do you even give a shit, huh? I know that 18 years ago, Suzumori was shot and killed. But not by you. Mm. And yet, you turned yourself in to save your family. I mean, everyone knew you didn't do it. The director of criminal affairs, the judge, the jurors. Come on, Kasuga. You served your time. Why are you still lying? Still very good questions. You know he's a detective. I did it. Bullshit. Sure, you're a real piece of work. Well, you're a big pain in my ass. When are you gonna oh. drop the act? My act? The detective shtick. Why are you following me around? There's no way an old fart one breath away from retirement suddenly decides to babysit an ex-con. Who are you really? What the hell's your angle here, man? Oh, you can ask good questions I as well. <laughs> well? Exposition time. Oh, no. <laughs> well, you definitely know it's Arakawa. That scar. The goatee. The Sylvester Stallone hat. Who's this dude? That guy is Arakawa san, isn't he? Why are you asking? Who the hell are you? You some kind of reporter? No. We don't do media. So get out of here. Go on. Beat it. You don't understand. Just beat it. I used to be a member of the Arakawa beat it. family. If you were from the family, then we would know who you are. I've been in prison for 18 years. I just got out today. Hmm. If you're gonna lie, you're gonna have to do better than that. Just let me talk to Arakawa-san. You'll be glad to see me, so let me through. Hey, hold your horses there, dumbass. You don't know what you're dealing with. Yeah, mm -hmm. they're busy visiting an important grave today. Go on, get out of here. I didn't do 18 years for this shit. Step aside. If you don't, they're gonna have two more graves to visit today! Fight! The battle is on! Cool. Okay, right, let's see. Good to see, all the levels are still there. Tenacious Fist, perfect. Right, in that case, let's do it. Tenacious Fist, uh, on this guy. Bonk. Ow. Okay, you, you want to still try it. Fair enough. Oh, okay, he's not... Haha. 
What have we got on it? Oh, we don't need that. Tag out. There's no one to tag out to. Uh, skills. Let's go again. Quick, quick. No? Okay. Come on. Oh, ow. One more time. There we go. Good old level up. You bastard. You think you're getting away with this? Uh you want some more? Enough, Kasuga. Hey fellas, we're sorry, okay? Now my friend here, he's he's a little crazy, that's all. He's not crazy. He's the hell you say about me? Mad. Give him a good talking to. Sorry about all this. We'll get out of here. Yeah. Yeah, better. Don't you get it? That's my boss. Oh, son. It's me. I got out today. It's Ichiban. Ichiban Kasuga. Let's keep going, boys. Why didn't he recognize me? You were gone for 18 years. Isn't it possible he forgot who you were? Uh, no way. He didn't forget me. I mean, shit. He sent me a letter in prison. I'm sure he just didn't hear me. He's older, you know? His ears are starting to go and his eyes, too. So naive. He definitely heard you. Pretty sure your eyes met too. No, he didn't. I understand it's a hard thing to accept, Kasuga. But mm. take a hint. Best case scenario, he simply forgot about you. Yeah. If he does actually remember you, then clearly he doesn't want to talk to you. That's not true. No. There's just no way. I know the problem. <laughs> what now? Think. Why would he be here? Visiting a grave, probably. Exactly. Visiting Susamori's grave. No, you've just been cleaning it, you idiot. And I bet if he saw me standing right next to it, he'd recognize me on the spot. Yeah. All I gotta do is make sure he sees me right here, and hey, look at that. Visiting that grave. He's uh, definitely visiting a different grave. Of course he was. That's that's the former Omi chairman's grave. The Omi Alliance, the yakuza who run Kansai. Why would he visit that grave? Not anymore. There's so many guys. Uh, there's about it's like six yakuza games that could, you know. He's an Omi officer. <laughs> Listen here, old timer. Those guys we just finished fighting said they were Arakawa. Didn't you hear them? Well, the Arakawa family is from the Tojo clan. Tojo clan. Everyone knows they've been at war with the Omi for ages. 18 years is a long time, Ichiban. <laughs> the Arakawa family isn't Tojo anymore. Metal Gear. What did you just say? You just Hatsune said it. Arakawa is currently the acting captain of the Omi Alliance. He's the second in command. What oh, are you oh. talking about? That can't be true. It is. I knew you wouldn't believe me. But think about it. Arakawa was the patriarch of the third string family of the Tojo clan. Mm -hmm. Now it's exposition time. But the tides changed for him too. Wait, hold on. Ago. So you didn't say anything and then got in the car and then carried on. <laughs> Scrub the city of crime. He started with targeted attacks on all Tojo's sources of funding. He called oh, it's that guy. Kamracho 3K plan. The hell's that? 
an anti-Yakuza policy. Keep them hungry, keep them poor, and keep them out. Three Ks. The oh. police started raiding major Yakuza families with surgical precision. Family officers were being arrested one after the other. There was just one exception. The Arakawa family. Huh? I see. That shouldn't come as a surprise. The reason the police were able to destroy the Tojo clan so fast was because they had inside intel from the Arakawa family. Basically, oh. Masumi Arakawa sold out the Tojo clan to the cops. They all are no, peeking duck. <laughs> I'm not even finished with the story yet. With oh. the Tojo clan almost completely wiped off the map, the Omi seized the opportunity and poured their guys into Kamurocho. <laughs> they looked the other way. Okay. Arakawa must have slipped them a little something under the table. Definitely peeking duck. I'm talking about a bribe, dumbass. Arakawa <laughs> slipped the police some cash so they would ignore the Omi Alliance's expansion. And that's how they took control of Kamurocho without spilling a single drop of blood. Oh. To pay back the favor, they welcomed Masumi Arakawa into their organization as the acting captain. Meanwhile, in the eyes of Tojo clan, Arakawa had committed high treason. So what little mm -hmm. of the Tojo remains will occasionally attack the Omi, but it's pitiful. I'm sorry to tell you all this, but you had to find out sooner or later. Don't let yeah. you down. I had nothing to do with you. You okay? You feeling all right? Nothing is fucking all right! Yeah, didn't think so. Arakawa-san defecting to the Omi? The Tojo clan is gone? You 18 years. You're a fucking terrible liar. So you don't believe me? No way in hell it went down like that. Arakawa-san was like the walking image of duty and honor. Arakawa the assassin. Him. He was visiting an Omi grave. Think about that. That wasn't Arakawa-san. I haven't seen the guy for 18 years, so how am I supposed to recognize him? Oh my god. Now that I think about it, that guy wasn't even wearing clothes that Arakawa-san would wear. <sighs> Thanks, skin shirt, you the glove, the hat. The identified themselves as Arakawa. Yeah. I... We must have misheard him. Now, this is a bad Ace Attorney game. Anyway. This is the way to Kamurocho. We're going to Yokohama. What? Yokohama. I need to get to Kamurocho. I told you, there's nothing for you there. Now come with me to Yokohama. As I've said, the two of us have business to attend to. Enough mystery. What business? Yeah. An investigation. You are going to help me with it. I want some part cars illegally? Why should I help you with anything, huh? Oh, I'm sorry. Did you think you had a choice in the matter? Soon we'll be in Kanagawa Prefecture, my jurisdiction. Now calm down, and let's have some peace and quiet. Hmm? You know what? Stop the car right now, or else I'll fuck you up! Hey, Kasuga! If you won't come the easy way, I can make up a reason to do it the hard way. You want that? Mm. Now the threats are starting, huh? Well, at least they make you seem like a real cop. Oh, is that right? Like any dirty cop, you're coming up with some bullshit story to trick me. So what is it? Lizards. For me to do some of your dirty work? I can see right through you, fucker. What family in Yokohama are you from? Wow. I showed you my badge, remember? But I guess there's no cure for stupid. He is an absolute fool. You think I'm gonna fall for that bullshit? Hey, what do you think you're doing, you idiot? That's my badge. Where do you think you're going? The camera show. Obviously. Were you even listening to me? No. You really need to drop the detective act already. It's obvious you're Yokohama Yakuza. And hey, at least I'll get one hell of a story out of this. How I nearly got kidnapped right out of prison. Yep, he's lost him. Such a dumbass. I have to go find Arakawa-san now. He's somewhere in Kamurocho waiting for me. Look, thanks Ooh. for testing my instincts after I was in the joint for so long. Now see ya. His instincts. Promise, There's nothing left for you. Oh, wrong. Oh, damn it. I 
Thought shit might go sideways. Guess he has to see it for himself. Oh, he knew this was going to happen. Wonderful. Anyway. Let's go to camera show. Oh, what a fish out of water. Phones? With screens on them? Is that a cigarette? <laughs> Vapes? Um... Hello? Help? Yep. First thing says, need to stop by the office. Oh, you don't want to be going to the office. Anyway, let's save. Here we go. Alright. So we got, we got that. And this, obviously, there's the sexy club. Uh, we've got an alley to go down here. We could go down there. Yeah, down the alleyway. Well, this didn't seem like the right way to go. Hello? Hey, come by. Uh, yeah, this was, this was, this literally led to nowhere. Some stairs. There's a, there's a door here. Hi guys, um, I'm just in your storage room. Don't worry, don't worry about it. Oh, what, what is this for? Oh, hi, it's, oh, it's Kathy, Kathy Alps. We just go through the back entrance. Okay, so, uh, Club Sega. You reckon things may have changed after 18 years and you would be wrong. Kind of. I mean, now... There's Virtual Fighter 5 here. We've still got Space Harrier, Virtual Fighter 2, Fantasy Zone. Alright, mate. How are you going? Okay, alright. Alright, you obviously don't want to. Alright, bye. Alright, to the office. Da da la da la da da. Okay. Hello? This is it, isn't it? Well, it was. Hey, are you supposed to be here? You got any yeah. idea what happened to the office that used to be here? <laughs> office? This used to be, you know, a girl's bar. Oh. What about before that? There was an office here. No, before the bar, it was a computer store. Before that, it was a maid cafe. Mm -hmm. Before that, mm -hmm. a Filipino bar, I think. But 18 years ago, a, a family had their office here. The Arakawa family. Don't you know what I'm talking about? A family? Not a family family. I... A Yakuza office, okay? Anyway, I know it was here. Oh. Uh, that's too far back even for my old bones. <laughs> but I'll be honest with you, I don't see how the Arakawa family could have been holed up in a dinky office like this. Oh. So you do know them? I don't think there's a soul on this side of town who doesn't. They're a yeah. huge, famous family. Really? Finally, some good news. So where Never are good they? news. I'm looking for them. <sighs> Not sure. In this day and age, Yakuza can't exactly be loud and proud, you know. Especially not hot shots like the Arakawa boys. I get it. Okay, thanks. Think you'll find them? Yeah. Maybe. Well, I'll just ask the old woman at the SIG stand where they're headquartered. 18 no years, man. Back. Okay, good luck. Not learning. <laughs> Oh dear, he's... He's gonna learn very quickly, isn't he? 
Well, you'd, you'd think. Anyway, let's go up here. Come on here. And... Where's the old woman? Oh, you mean the previous owner? <laughs> she moved back to the countryside a long time ago. Womp womp. Probably taking it easy in an old folks home by now. Oh, I see. 18 years. Hey, do you know where the Arakawa family office is? If, if you're not making a purchase, I should help the customer behind you. I just want to know where the Arakawa office is. Hey, some of us got places to be. Give me the usual. Okay. Yes, here you are. 500 yen, please. Just put it on my tab. Wow. People sure have gotten rude since I was gone. How pathetic. You say something? Where did yeah. you learn your manners, huh? Mom raised you in a barn? Jeez. And you're walking around town wearing a Tojo badge? Oh, wait. It's Omi Alliance. So, you're in the know. What family are you from? Me? I'm Arakawa. Oh, uh, nice to meet you, brother. Sorry I didn't know you. I'm new. Like hell you are! You're lying! Out here with the Omi symbols, faking like you're Arakawa! Wait, were you in that crew that visited the old chairman's grave today? <laughs> oh, yeah, there was a big ceremony scheduled. But only the Patriarch and his officers go to stuff like that. Maybe some of their assistants, too, but that's it. Damn, you must be newer than me. Who's our patriarch right now? Dude, you living under a rock? Just tell me who it is. It's acting captain of the Omi Alliance, Masumi Arakawa, obviously. You've been told, man. Man, you forgot the name of your patriarch? Get your shit together. Uh, amnesia? You don't order me to do anything. I'm not Omi. Well, oh, but you just said you were in the Arakawa family. Yeah. Damn right. And that family is part of the Tojo clan. How many Tojo more times clan. do we need to tell him about 18 years, everyone? How many more times? Do I look fucking asleep? No. Well, you do look like you've got a, like be one of those Tojo pests still crawling around. Uh, got permission from oh, good. To exterminate them on sight. You owe me are the ones who invaded. This city is Tojo turf. Not anymore. I do Tojo roaches need to die already. White. Yep, Tommy. The battle is on. Hey, he's got a baseball bat. Yeah. I want a baseball bat. Come on now. Check this out. I guess I'm not gonna get one. You're in it now. Hey, stunned. Cool. cool. Okay, it's just punch him. Okay, uh, maybe I should have punched him a bit more. Ow! Fine. Here, tenacious fist. Yeah. Did Arakawa san really betray the Tojo clan and run to the Yomi? Answer me! Yes! Haniki! That guy's a Tojo loyalist! Get him! What? Get back. Run away! Where'd he go? Huh? Oh. Oh. Okay. Now there's a guy in a maroon shirt or oh, suit. Oh, you're in the you're in the champion district. <laughs> hey, it's the drunk mama. Michio. Things definitely have changed now, eh? Giving up the smoking and the drinking. <laughs> Moonshine Michio. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, Michi, me, me, yeah, Michio. Yes, well, th thank you for the hints, yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. Let us know what's happened. What? It's a health food cafe. Oh, damn. <sighs> Oh, Lucio. Hmm? Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, him, I thought it meant like. The magazine. Writer! <laughs> oh. Thanks. Children's Park. Off we go! Aha, divine. <sighs> oh no, it's a pyramid scheme. See ya. Yeah, yeah, bye. Run away. Or casually walk away. Well, off you go. Well, you know what? Shall we just have a quick look? Nope, nope, sorry guys, nope, excuse me, coming through, coming through, um, around here, around here. Where was it? It was round the corner, wasn't it? There was a place called Syntax Error. Ah, oh, so it was here, oh god, it really is! An organic cafe. Coffee and food. Opens at 1, closes at 11. Oh well, good to know. Right. Off we go. Sorry. Come through. Right, it's a children's park. Uh, just leave them to it. No point in ending up in fights at the moment while there's nothing much that can be done. Just run faster than this car. Hi guys. This is the Beyond Building. Huh. Oh. Joy sound. Wait, where's the That's a point. Where's the Millennium Tower? Ah, oh, I've got lost around it up high. Camera. Hmm. Uh, million yen a shot. What? Thank you. Nice catch, by the way. Just. Is that a noise? Because usually that's supposed to be. <laughs> hey. But he was so dead on the floor that it should have just been. Uh. Hmm? <laughs> oh, you said his name. Tojo Clang, hi, yeah. Red suit, scraggly hair. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, you do stand out like a sore thumb. <laughs> oh, Phyto, Phyto. Get him! Whoa! Let's go! Okay. Scissors? Well, I guess we will uh, take out you first. 
Get out of here. Right, there. Nice 37 damage and missed. And you can have another tenacious fist. Oh my god, you're still alive. Ow. Alright, fine. Here we go. Eat it. Oh, so close to level 5. Damn, you're strong. We're gonna remember your faith, dick. I mean, is it really hard to forget? You ought to love being alive more. Else who's gonna take care of that precious camera? Yep. Oh, why are you taking snapshots? Between the Omi Alliance and the Tojo Clan loyalists. Oh yeah, these pics are go for a fortune. Thanks, Ichiban. Hey, hold up. Yeah, get hold on. Yeah, get back here. Oop. Oh, after all that. That guy. It was your fault anyway. Come on, get out of here. Bye. If I see you again, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Yeah, that's really great, that's isn't it? Yeah. Guy who just took off screaming. You're just gonna yeah, beat the hell out of a mascot. Oh god, it's Kamulo. It's the local mascot they made to improve Kamurocho's image. Oh no. Hell is a local mascot. <sighs> We're gonna be here all day. Remember yep. the internet? Yep. Ichiban exposition. Now. Use it. Fine. Just tell me what happened to the Arakawa family and Arakawa son. Oh, have you got a few minutes? Because we're near a break at this point. That family once upon a time, right? Stop. You gotta know what happened. Being the local reporter, I don't believe that Arakawa son was a traitor. It wasn't who he was. Are you sure? You really want to know why Arakawa did what he did? Bam, no. this too. I'm not a journalist for nothing. So tell me, when did you get locked up again? January 1st, 2001. And Arakawa had a son, right? Yeah, the young master. It used to be my job to escort him. Mm hmm. I don't know the details, but he was kind of sickly, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. What do you mean, was? Is he better now? He's dead. What? When? Oh. How? Hmm. Would have been about three years after you went into the slammer. As I recall, his condition got worse. There was nothing they could do. Arakawa was pretty fond of him, or so I assume. Yeah, he wasn't he replicated, but you know. Fond of him. Arakawa's son would have died for his son. Maybe the loss changed his perspective on things. Nothing worse than burying your own kid. Yeah. I can't imagine how that must have felt. Oh. But. I still don't see how that would make him betray the Tojo clan. Well, what the hell else was there to do? You don't. Maybe you can't understand, but once you have a child, the rest of your life is over. The kid becomes your life's purpose, you know? So mm -hmm. imagine the grief you'd feel if the kid dies. You just keep existing with your life's purpose pulled out from under you. The parents gotta find another reason, any other reason, to keep living. Couple that Same. with the fact that Arakawa is a Yakuza. I think maybe his new reason to live became watching the world burn. I don't want to set the world on fire. Give me some info now. You really in trouble with the Omi, like those thugs said? Uh, yeah, just a little. Yeah, and you shouldn't just be strolling around Kamurocho. Mm -hmm. You still got business here? If not, I'd get out of town. Fine. I promise, Kasuga, there's nothing left for you in Kamrocho. But he wasn't joking. Then where would I go? Any way away from here? I mean, I don't know, dude. I'm just saying the Omi are looking for you. So I'd get out of town if I were you. Don't go home. Home? Yeah, the soap land you were born in? That'd be your home, right? Shangri-La. Hey, you're not going there now, are you? Don't do it. I'm telling you, they'll kill you. Well, <laughs> let him try. 
always become all morose. What are we gonna do with him? Uh, that's right, continue the game and head straight to the place that he's not supposed to go. Right, okay, so we're gonna... Yeah, let's, let's, let's go and have a fight with these gits. Let's see, let's aim for the punk link. He's level 1, so, you know. Goodbye, you. Which means now we're left with... No, don't call the backup. Haha! <laughs> right, let's whack you. Ha! Right. Let's hit him again. This time. 38 this time. Leveled up yet? Yay! Level 5, which means. Yep. Learn the character skill Charismatic Persuasion. Cool. So, because we've done that, all the health in a. Man? Is back. Alright guys, how's it going? How's it going? Oh uh, well, I guess we're gonna have to fight more dudes. Oh no, no, no don't trip over bikes. Alright guys, see this uh, newbie Yakuza here? Uh, it's just... Go by him. And then you... Missed! Charismatic Persuasion. Attempt to brainwash the enemy. If successful, the enemy will drop an item and flee. Has a greater chance of success as Kazuka's charisma, <laughs> charisma improves. Of course it does. Well anyway... Oop. Yeah, remember there's a... Oh, God. Ow. Get out of here. Hey, right. To Shangri-La. Me, come through... Oh, nope. I'll go through that way. Uh, go around here. How do I check the map on that? Ah, there we go. Yeah, so straight down here. Excuse me, coming through, coming through. Hi guys, sorry, sorry guys, sorry, sorry. That's a bike. Why are you running away? Yeah. It's a ruin. It's true. Never thought I'd outlive Shangri-La. To be fair, it happened. What? It was only a couple of years after him getting on your tour of imprisoned. I'm trying to remember if like the first Yakuza was set in like 2002, something like that. So yeah, it would have been. For real, unbelievable, you know. isn't it? A neon bright paradise like Kamurocho, and here's this dark, rotting husk. He's not listening to you. Do you know? There was a Tojo clan civil war. Some moron drove a dump truck through the place. Oh, uh, what's that? Come near it ever since. That Mashima. I think I think it might. Have been. Real messed up dudes live in there now. I see. I guess I never realized just how long 18 years really is. Well, yeah, no, now. That's not the Kamurocho you remember. I know that must be shitty. Did you see what they built on Nakamichi Street? What? The new Kamuro police station. Just <laughs> one more set of prying eyes watching everything in this town. That's because of the 3K plan. Without the Tojo clan. Oh, that used to be the theater entrance. The station finally got built. That's why everybody loves our go getter of a governor. The Kamuro police station is just one of his legacies. <laughs> well. That shit doesn't matter to me anymore. Meh. Kasuga, I've been nothing but honest with you. I tried to tell you before. The Tojo clan you know is gone. All you had to do was listen. The from Kansai invaded and won. They rule this city now. So, do you believe me now? Yeah, there's something. Just a little. We're making good time. There we go. You came oh. around faster than I thought. <laughs> I knew you were the kind of guy who has to see shit for himself. And everyone else be damned. Yep. So I had to let you walk around Kamarocho until it all clicked for you. <laughs> and you got there quick. Yes, he did. Doing? Trying to guess everything I do? Making fun of me along the way? Well, I didn't guess everything. I 
just knew you'd come here. <sighs> Look, man, once and for told all, you twice. What the hell do you really want? I want you to help me with my investigation. Huh? Arakawa, mm -hmm. your former boss, used the police to crush the Tojo clan. Then he gave Kamurocho to the Omi Alliance on a silver platter. You and I both know you can't buy out the police with just Yakuza pocket change. Well, he, he did. In my theory, some of that money went directly to Juro Horonouchi, the police commissioner. The police commissioner? Yeah. Then I got a bone yeah, to pick that guy. I'd love to see the son of a bitch fired. Of course, I'm just a driver's ed teacher now, so I don't have a lot of chances to get at him. Mm -hmm. But one chance I do have as if I go through Masumi Arakawa. Oh. You figure I can help you get to Arakawa-san. Is that it? Congrats. You solved the puzzle. I thought you'd be game because, come on, aren't you dying to know why he turned traitor? Yeah. But if you don't agree, why don't you tell me? What are you going to do now? Hmm? I want to see Arakawa-san. It's all I thought about in prison. I just want to see him, talk to him. Yeah. Your information. Tonight, Arakawa is bringing some Omi officers to a big meeting with local patriarchs. Really? That true? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know why I'm We're going. Yeah. Talking about a sweet little tea party. No, it's gonna be a show of arms. With Arakawa, it's a critical moment. He needs to show his dominance. How do you know this? I still have my connections from when I was a detective. Of, of course you do. Grease some hands, of course. Go figure. Well, where's this meeting gonna be? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Dungeon time? I mean, it might be dungeon time. Or building time, you know. The usual. Or oh, exposition. <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, so I was having a conversation, and uh, you're also having a conversation. We're we're just gonna have, you know, a conversation. Everyone, clear out. Blah blah blah. Hey on tower. Hey on tower. Hey. Oh, that's. Um, oh, have you been there? It's a pretty classy joint. Expensive as hell, though. No, I haven't gone. It's just, uh, her Kawasan once promised to take me there. To Not for peeking dog. Wait, I get it. This is Arakawa-san trying to contact me! Oh dear god, man. Wait, wait, what are you saying? It can't be a coincidence that the meeting is going down there! No, Peking Duck it's equals betrayal, man! Come on! Of course it could be a coincidence. Come back down to Earth, kid. <laughs> yeah. There aren't many classy restaurants around here. Period. Stands to reason he picked one of the only ones. Hmm? Eh. Screw you! It doesn't even matter. What's important is, I can finally talk to him! Okay. Aye, First aye, of all, aye. the meeting isn't until tonight. And on top of that, the Omi know you're a Tojo loyalist. If they catch you, then you'll have zero chance of talking to Arakawa. Not, not thinking now, it through, really, is he? Let's, to sneaking in. Plus, let's be honest. You wanted to bust through the front door like an idiot. Okay, what kind of plan? Yeah, That's a idiot. surprise I'll save for later. Later? What, we're just gonna wait here till they show up? No, I'm sure yes. you shit to do, just like me. Let's split up and meet back here tonight. Here, take this with you. What is this? A phone! A smartphone. I assume you've seen one before? Nah. How do you use it? Why do they make phones so damn complicated? Smartphone unlocked! Just, figure it out. Just make sure to pick up when I call you. Whatever. You can now select smartphone from the pause menu. <laughs> Good. Right, now that it's given that little bit of tutorial, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a, a quick quick three-minute break. Um, go go stand up, because we'll be ready for more exposition and possibly some fighting uh, after that break. So, see you in a couple of minutes.
And we're back. So, okay, so let's carry on with some cutscenes, shall we? Theater square tonight. Till then, keep a low profile. Ah, <laughs> yeah, low profile. Kazuga, low profile. Hilarious. Oh, it's night time. Survive to keep a low profile until night. Let's go. Let's go meet Adachi. Here's me coming through, everyone. Now, why would you step back into me, you buffoon? Okay, we'll just go straight past those guys. Okay, they saw me. Right, you know what? Screw it. Gotta, gotta keep. Capitalist punch. Oh, you're just menacing men. Okay, fair enough. Oh, nice. That worked out very well. Just randomly pick up a traffic cone. I mean, they are everywhere. Oh, God, more businessmen, menacing men. Oh, there is a sign there as well. Haha! <laughs> so stunned. Still stunned. Therefore. Eat it. Oh, he got snapped out of it. And then hit the dirt again. It's always time to hit the dirt. Right. Hey, look, Pachinko. What slots? Let's play slots. Got here. Sure, slots, slots. Another god, Hades. Oh, no, okay. Okay, no. No. Oh, alright, fair enough, because we won't be playing slots. <laughs> Doesn't mean you need to go on the store page and download it at some point then. Onwards! To a manhole cover? And this great Adachi son's not even here. I'm sure this is where we're supposed to meet. Well, it is. You really should just and this, like, oh, this man with the purple cravat. Don't be sad. Remember what I said? You deal with business the way you do with fish and women catch, then release. Take pride in the catch, but then set them free. Any sporting fisherman can tell you that. Of course. Really? You want me back at the office? Yes. I hope you're joking. I pay you generously to deal with this nonsense. The uh, whole idea sorry. behind bringing you on was so that I could enjoy my nights off. Ciao. Ciao, baby. Wow. Typical. Hey, sorry to bother you when you're busy. What? You seen a burly looking guy in a blue coat around here? That's hey, not you. Burly looking guy? Sorry, my friend. Myself, I only pay attention to the ladies. Yeah, sure you do. Yes. Why don't you simply call this person? Is his phone dead? Oh, that's right. He gave me a smartphone to call him on. Uh, wait. How do you call someone on this thing? There's no. Oh dear. <laughs> Old man Kazuga. Behind the times, aren't you? Hey, here, allow me. You'll show me. I'll make you the smartest of smartphone users. Hey, Kazuka's gonna hey, level up you? smartphone proficiency. You're not gonna weasel out of it this time, asshole. Shit, Yomi found me. Oh? Huh? Shiko got a new cravat wearing fuckwad. When are you gonna do right by us? And who are you, might I ask? You don't remember us? You sold us that shit property. Ah, that Yakuza, weren't you? The one who bought the deed for a most successful girls' bar. <laughs> successful, my ass. It barely makes any money. You need to make this right, you shyster. Ah, oh, now that is strange. It certainly had a high profit margin while I was running it. The joint's in the red every month. Girls keep quitting, not enough customers. I can't even pay the electric bill. Uh. <laughs> 
I dare say you'll have to become better at managing a business. Fuck you say? Uh -uh. This was a crap business when you pawned it off on me. You better buy it back now. <laughs> <laughs> you are a funny guy. Asshole. Do you even realize you're mocking the Omi Alliance? Oh, the Omi Alliance. You know, as opposed to an Omi Alliance. This guy was about to teach me to use a smartphone. <laughs> what, a, what a way to drop a conversation, it's like, wait, this guy was going to teach me technology? Can you, can you just stop at the moment? Oh, you... No. Ah, so you're an aggressive type yourself, huh? Something like why don't you stand back, Mr. What was it? Nick Ogata? This is about to get ugly. Okay. See that? Will you be fine handling this by yourself? Hell yeah. And you can repay me in smartphone lessons. Sound good? <laughs> Very good. Quit your yapping. Good old trade. You got nobody to thank but your own hair. What? Yep, the battle is on. Okay, fair enough. Right, it's time for you to get your ass kicked. Right, which one? Well, uh, let's aim for you first. Oh, oh you're still... Ow. Hey, hey, hey! Okay, right. Oh, oh you get... Come on. Nope, oh, pain. Guarded them, though. Okay, right. Ha ha! Whack! Your turn. Oh, stare down. Fear. Oh, good, you overcame the fear. Cool. You missed. Right. You're not in the way now, so get out of here. It's for you. Tenacious fist time. Ah! Oh good, you're stunned. Well, that gives me another time to use the Tenacious Fist. Eat it. Oh, what? Damn it, one fight away from leveling the rank. Alright, beat it. <laughs> that looks painful. So, in all honesty, did you sell them a crappy business or not? I certainly did not. It was raking in millions of yen each month at the time of sale. A wonderful little property. If that's true, why'd you offload it? The riffraff you just beat down were insisting on protection money. <laughs> uh -huh. I didn't want their protection. We were only asking for a measly hundred thou a month, man. You wouldn't even make a dent in what you were pulling in. Yes, I recall it being something like that. So you know what I told them? If you think it's so easy, why don't you try running it? Uh... You sold it to him just to make a point? You bet I did. I, I mean, can you believe their arrogance? A measly hundred thou? <laughs> I have a number of businesses, and yes, they do bring in hundreds of millions of yen per month. But the reason for that is I know the value of money. It's very difficult for a small business to make a hundred thou. Ah, so you wanted them to learn just how much work goes into it. Exactly. And I believe now they have definitely... That's right, buy it. If you don't know how to run it, you lose money, and then you try and, uh, you know, beat it back out of people, and you get your asses kicked. That's exactly how you run a business, right? You need passion, and you need to work your ass off to make her happy. Are, are you talking about women again? Are you gonna do what yeah, misogynist. Fuck that, I'm done sinking money into that bottomless pit. Fine. I'll buy it back from you. But for half of what you paid me. Lesson learned. You. But fine, take it. I don't care anymore. Sweet. <sighs> I don't believe I caught your name. Kasuga. Ichiban Kasuga. Ichiban. <laughs> that means number one, doesn't it? <laughs> That's a lot to mm. live up to, but you certainly did that tonight. Thanks for your help. Sure thing. And, uh, 
speaking of help. Yes. You want to learn how to work a smartphone, correct? Uh, yes, please. Don't worry, I didn't forget. Let's get to it. Where's your phone? Here it is. <laughs> wow. I actually feel like I can make use of this thing now. Thanks, Nick. <laughs> You're welcome. Mayhaps we should keep in touch. When I meet interesting people, I like to think there's a reason why. Oh, good. We can be pen pals. <laughs> um, if you want. But I got kind of a history, in case you couldn't tell. I got out of prison. You need today. to war, war to everyone, so. <laughs> Hi, I'm an ex-con. Sort of How's it going? Well, you should probably know. I was charged with murder. You didn't Is need to know. So? Oh, my. You are interesting. Oh, you, you just... I see you, <laughs> you're piquing his curiosity a little bit more. You've got more honesty than sense. Absolutely. Oh, yeah? You might say I associate with people who have... Well, all kinds of baggage. Oh, good. Many of them are carrying much more than you. No kidding. I'm starting to think you're shadier than the guys I knew in prison. <laughs> Bad news for me if that's what a felon thinks. One point for Mr. Number One. Guess one point to one. Well, see you around, Ichiban. You're not gonna just randomly call me or anything, are you? I just might. You'll find me to be a very person. Well, there's a wink. I'm gonna introduce you. Oh, oh you turn up. Kasuga. Who is that guy? First pen pal, I guess. Huh? Hey, what took you so long anyway, man? You're the one who set this whole thing up. <laughs> yes. Oh, I was hungry, so I went and got a beef ball. You prick! I ordered an extra large one and Ooh. it was a struggle. <laughs> guess I'm getting old. Do you let Ichiban go hungry, you prick. Well here I am, about to sneak into a high level Omi meeting. Yeah. Well, hope you're ready. Uh, yeah, I am now, thanks. Maybe, in fact, actually, where's a place to... Where's a food place? Uh, I'll just head up here. Eat. Regen health. And then there. Hello. Welcome to Smile Burger, home of the Smile Burger. How may I take your order? Oh, Jesus. Let's select from the menu. Right, so we want... We're gonna get... Uh, a Smile Burger. Right, yeah, we'll get some... Well, no, no, what? Okay, alright, I'll check it. We'll get a Smile Burger, we'll get some fries. And we'll get a shake. There we go. Confirm the order. Who's... I'm hungry. Ah. Meal. Sweet. Really? We didn't learn a combo? Oh. Boo. Anyway, all healed up and we'll save again. Right. Let's go. All right, come on, Adachi. Yo. Okay. Yeah, let's go. To what is clearly a sewer. Okay. Uh, For real? For real? No, this is the I don't mm, 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 mm. None of that. This is this is not persona. We are not going to be putting on a for real count. Just be silly. And why would you do that? Hmm? Anyway. Yeah. Okay. Let's. Uh, yep. New retirement. <sighs> Who found out where he was? You. Okay. 
Hey! We got a party member! <laughs> ah, good, good start. Yep. Yeah, you know, getting away with that. Who killed him? Me. Who really killed him? I don't know. Welcome. Dungeon time. Will this place even take us anywhere? Yeah, should lead us straight to our building. Careful though. Never know what kind of lunatics you'll run into. Eh, yeah. Yeah. All right, lunatics. Bomb bug. Okay, right. That's uh, tenacious fist. You. You're still alive. Let's just whack you while you're on the floor. There you go. Good follow-up attack. Hey. No. Oh, hey. Fine. Let's just punch the heck out of you. You hit the floor, and then we'll do a follow-up attack on you. <laughs> no, 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 no. We don't. We don't. We don't need you coming in here and uh, doing that. Goodbye. I know the sound's just gone, but I'm just gonna sort something out. There we go. Good. Goodbye, person. Hey, ranked up. Sweet. Sorry about that. Had to ban a spammer. Ooh, what have we got here? Oops. Mysterious mushrooms. They're very mysterious. Okay. Let's keep going. Alright, guys. Silly menacing men. We've got an, unbo an unboxer. Well, in that case. Here, have this. Ow. No, don't get up. Let's Goodbye. Go. There's a perfect guard. Hey, tenacious fist. Let's go. Let's go. And just whack him while he's down. Perfect. Taunt. No. What's your skill? Beat down. Cool. Let's give it a try. It's the time you want. Oh, missed it. Fine though, everything's good. You don't want to moan about your battle. Wow, well, that is huge. Okay, let's just do this to you. Fall over. Ow. Leave him alone. Oh. Missed it. It's fine now. Everyone's learning stuff. It's all great. Right, so... That's clearly our way to the place. He says, "Hey, we got a case. Hardball. Sure. Let's keep uh, kicking the crap out of people and just use them to level up a little bit. Wow, there's a lot of people around here. Bye, bomb bugs. Let's uh, not forget how to." punch them this time. Okay. Suspicious behavior. Sure. Oh, crit. And stay down. Good, everyone's learning there. 
Alright guys. Should level up a couple of... Well, we should both level up... Oh, okay, you've decided to come forward, so... Uh, da. Painful. Fall over. Uh, you better not be igniting a bottle. Okay, cool, you have just opened up. Him out. Fall down. Do that before he tries to run in and uh, get in the way. Kasuga, why? It's fine, you've just helped. Still, sort out your anger, man. Yeah, you'll uh, rank up. Everything going. All the new skills. It's all great. Oh, look, another mysterious mushroom. Alright, guys. How's it going? Uh, let's just whack you. Can he get past? I don't think he's going to. He does. Yeah. Ow, leave him Hit the floor. Let's go. Stay on the floor. The enemy is defeated. Good. Kazuka's nearly leveled up. And up, oh, excuse me. Oh, another hardball. Oh, will you stop running in my way? Okay, so we now have these guys. Hello. Oh, oh, we've got Yakuza who's level six now, and you're running right in front of me, so you're gonna be the one on the floor. Of course, you're still alive. Uh, hey. Well, also, hey. Uh, oh. Fall down now. Stay down. Right, unboxer, your turn. <sighs> oh, he's so angry. Hit him while he's on the floor. Goodbye. Right, bomb bug. Are you not angry anymore? Good. What are you doing? You know, throw him on the floor. What did you just try and kick? Because it didn't look like anything happened. Hey, two levels up. Good. All the health comes back. And we can now move on. Double check that we're not. Hey, save and heal points. Okay. Anyway, whatever that is, it's dirty. So we're just gonna go back round because there's a little bit of this dungeon we've still not explored yet. A bit down here. All right, guys. Hello. Tenacious Fist on the Yakuza. And then the Beatdown on the Yakuza. Oh no, don't be igniting bottles now. Stunned. Good. Whack. Oh, don't ignite. Stop igniting balls. So he's stunned, so that's not going to happen. I'm going to stop you from igniting a bottle. 
Hit the floor, perfect. You just get hit. That's fine. He's still stunned. He's still stunned. You can just punch him. Everything is fine. There you go, fall them. Oof. Face, meet Gerda. Right. What was this worth? Mysterious leaf. So two mysterious mushrooms, a mysterious leaf, two hardballs, and a... Oh. Dirty something. Items. Valuables? Wait, where did it go? It's gear. It is gear, isn't it? Yep. Used hand towel. Well, bit of magic. <laughs> bit of defense. It's fine by me. Alright, Kazuga, let's go. We'll heal up, use our cell at your save point, and move on. Go! Perfect. Everything is fine. Oh. Up we go! Yes. Let's do it. Let's move on. <sighs> what do you think you're doing here? Welcome to the party, pal. We're all awake already. Security guards. Okay, right. Oh, pain. Right. You. I don't know if I've actually pushed the button at the right time. No, not diving headlock. Ow, ow. Right, leave me alone. Right, he's, he's fine. Okay, you are getting in the way. Fall down. You. Also fall down. Oh, ow. Right, he's gone. Here we go. I don't know if I'm doing it right. Well, you know. Goodbye. Need a bit of stuff. Perfect. Yo. Yeah, yo. Alright, anyway, while well, we see you. Half eaten bento. Sure. Just, just lay there on the. I say lay there. And what's in this? Stamina and light. Oh, okay. Right. Up the lift we go. And. A stretch shirt. Gear! Hitch man. Optimal gear. Go. Sorry, Dachi, it's not me. Yeah. Open door. Huh? Who the fuck are you? Uh, we got lost. It's not gonna work, is it? Cool. Okay, Army Alliance member. Check you. Goodbye. Let's go. What's Slick Tongue do? Ah. You're in it now. Right. Going in. Uh, 
gun. Eat it. Right. Had a bit of experience. Hopefully, there should be. Nope. Not, not a chance in terms of level ups. Not at all. Hey. Okay. Oh, more dudes. Damn. Leap of faith. Ooh. Well, before we do that, more loot on the floor. Another mysterious leaf. Cool. Two uh... men. One balcony. One leap of faith. Good. Bye. And then, then the other guys. Okay, right, now, time to get rid of some dudes here, let's... Here. There's one. Uh, you. Ow, ow, ow. Oh no, Kazuki, you're bleeding. Ow, ow. Fine, you're good. Right, there. So now we're just left with Hadori, the big guy. That's, there we go, much better. Stop bleeding. It's fine though, I'm so enraged he's not going to be able to do anything else. Fall over. Uh, no, 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 hit him before he... Oh, you are so close. Ow, pain. That's fine. Should be able to whack him. There we go. Little mini boss fight. All done. Hey, you've leveled up and ranked up. You're fine. Learn the job skill on guard. Oh. Cutsy. Hey, you leveled up. Got full health. Uh oh. Helicopter, no. Okay. Doors. Right. That just left the party. Now we're in a safe room. Which is good. Because, um... French fries! I needed to recover the health. Okay. Uh, can't save in here though. There is no save point. So. Hey, binding. Sweet. Finding more gear. Let's keep equipping the gear. Okay. Um, binding is a. There we go. HP increased by 20. He no longer has 169 health, so it's not as nice. Wait. Well, he does. But oh, that's because it's current. There we go. 189. Let's go. Just walk down here like we own the shop. Alright, alright, gentlemen. Well, well. Ready to die, punk? No. Not today. Right, Tenacious Fist on you! You're stunned, that's good. That's for you. Oof! It's a blinding shot! 
Let's try again. Right, he's gone. It's good. Uh, taunt. Oh, well, I don't play now. I'm just going to learn to to guard. Ow. Ah, oh, the rage has subsided. Let's go. You missed. Come with that. I thought you were going to throw that there. Anyway, there we go. Job rank up. Learn the job skill. Rock swing. Oh, good. Right, now what have we got in here? Hand grenade. You know, you just leave that lying around. Stamina and light. A string of gauze. Is that more gear? No. No, it is not. Okay. Oh, and here. You know, people are just mysteriously leaving those leaves around. Door. Captain Sawashiro. Oh, Ichi. It's been a while. Mm hmm. When'd you get out? Come on. I know you don't care when I got out. <laughs> Sounds like prison made you into a pessimist. Uh, yeah, you just a little. Us. We would have sent someone to pick you up. I wouldn't have wanted a ride from anyone wearing an Omi badge. Where were Times you have changed. Turned traitor. Watch your tongue, Ichi. He only did what anyone else would have done in times like these. Times like these, you Even betray if the everyone. Clan still existed. No one would have come to pick you up. You do realize that, right? Because if you remember, you were banished from the clan. Mm -hmm. Look, I'm not actually that hung up about the ride. And yeah, I remember the banishment. So what do you want? Did you come to beg for money? You know, no. I thought you might be grateful. Did you forget who spent 18 years eating prison slop in your place? Oh, I'm very aware of what you did. But you're not aware of what's happening tonight. What? It's a very important event for the boss. I can't risk one of his former grunts ruining it. So the That's choice fine. is yours. Leave like a good boy or die here. Boss fight. I'm going through that door and talking to my boss. <laughs> you know, I really forgot how seeing your stupid face always made me want to kill you. I thought the same thing about you. Every time you hit me for no reason. Well, it's been 18 long years. About time one of our dreams came true. Yay, dreams. They can come true all the time. Bitch and moan about it afterwards. So, I've not really got many skills here. Let's do it. Here we go. Oh, I still love that. Yeah. Okay, so here we go. What have we got? So we've got Rock Swing now. Damage an enemy by putting him in a headlock and throwing them. Cool. Let's go for it. Slide over there. Paint. Uh... Let's try and go for the Tenacious Fist again now. I'm trying to stun. Oh. Ah. Sometimes I love some of these fights. I'm glad you showed up. I've been waiting a long time for this. Ha <laughs> ha! Right. Hit the floor, man. Let's go again. Ridicule. Really? Didn't do anything. Oh! Oh yeah, just pick up a bot. In fact, that was better than the bloody fist. Cool. Go again. Maybe there's like a chair or something. No. Cold fury. Uh oh. The captain's got that freakish aura around him, and he's in a fighting stance. 
Time to learn how to guard. Bile blade of stealth. Sweet. Right, anyway, should now probably try and stun him again. He's still got that. Oof. Okay, let's keep going. Get stunned, man. That hurt. What I'm gonna do is we've got some. Yeah, let's have a salmon on a giri. <laughs> yeah, missed. Hit the floor. Oh, good, and his attack's gone. Hey, do you want a rock swing? I think you should have a rock swing. Nah. I'm fine. And another tenacious fist. And while you're down. Tempered safety class and luxurious belt. Yeah. <laughs> and up go the stats. Do you realize what you're doing? No. Once you go through that door, there's no turning back. Ichi, are you sure you're ready for that? Yes. Eighteen years. I've been waiting to open this goddamn door for 18 years. That's long enough! Boss. And who might this be? Pardon the interruption. It seems I have a guest. Yeah. So, you came. I figured you would. Well, absolutely. You never disappoint. <sighs> Boss, please just tell me. Why'd you do it? Hmm. Hold it. Captain, do we have a problem here? No, nothing serious. No need for you to worry. Boss, there's going to be a peeking duck situation. In fact, it's going as planned. I'm sorry, Ichi. You have to die. And there we go. That's chapter two complete. So, uh, yeah. You know how this works. We're only like a few minutes off the end of the stream, so I'm going to wrap this up, but I'm going to save it first so it's just ready for us to start from there. So, if you want to see more of this, and you, you want to be notified of when either I'm going to sit here playing Yakuza, which I'm going to explain now. The reason I'm doing it is just want to start just reducing the amount of games that I'm streaming so that I can play more of them on stream. And that's why Going Rogue's heading back to its uh, rightful place back on the YouTube channel. Um, the other idea is that I want to start getting through more games because there are couple of big games that I do want to start playing and streaming. One in sort of mid-September when it comes out is uh, the newest of the Tales of games. Which is Tales of Graces. No, not Graces. Tales of Arise. 
Graces was the PS3 one, which was also a pretty damn good game. Uh, also, still holding out and waiting for um, uh, Ruin King League of Legends story. Because that's, uh, that's also due to, to, to come out sometime this year. Um, but yeah, that's that's what we're doing as a variety streaming channel. That's how it's going to be. There's going to be a variety of us. There's going to be men, plenty of us. There's Terry and his X4 game, which he's most likely going to be playing. We've got Play Session tomorrow. Um, so there's going to be a whole bunch of Immaterial Gamers. Um, I know Duncan and Andrea had started doing a better together live for Neo, The World Ends With You. Uh, we'll see if that'll carry on again at some point. Um, and up, or coming up in the next month or so is the Immaterial Gamers Spooktober Spectacular. Our charity videos that we do is going to become charity streams. Five people pile in five different spooky or scary games with money that we're looking to raise for Cancer Research UK. And I know we're based in the UK and Canada, but that's sort of where it all started from there. But uh, I'll talk about that a little bit closer to the time in the next couple of weeks. So I'm going to take the stream down. Please, if you want to know when we're going to be doing this, give us a follow. Uh, if you do see us in the future and you want to support us um, financially, you can just subscribe to us as well. Um, remember, if you are on Prime Gaming and you are not using it, why not? It'll help us, like I say, increase or it'll shore up the architecture. And all that's left to say there is have a good rest of your Thursday while I find a channel to raid. Just to just to see if we've got people with that. I'm looking to see if there's anyone playing like a dragon at the moment. There is. We'll go ahead and do it. There are some games going on. Let's see. Have a look. What's coming on here? The viewers. So it looks like there's not much going on. <laughs> so um, yeah, you know what? Get get out of here! Stop! Stop! Stop that. No. Not enough to, to, to raid over. So, yeah, I'm going to wrap it up. Have a good rest of your Thursday. And we'll be back with Play Session tomorrow. Cheerio.